Good morning, everyone. Today we are in my bathroom. <laughs> and I'm going to be sharing a few of my favorite skincare items with you. And um, we're going to first start with talking about just skin because all of us have, you know, different concerns with our skin. Um, and for me, my skin is very acne prone, um, very acne prone. So um, skincare is really important for me. I also have um, dehydrated skin. It's not just dry skin that's flaky. It's actually dehydrated skin. So that's when um, your skin, especially in these thinner areas, begin to get like crepey and things like that because it's so dehydrated. So um, I also experience a little bit of oiliness. So I try to combat that as well, um, especially in the T-zone area, the chin area. Um, is always a little bit oily for me. So these skincare items really help me to main, maintenance my skin, maintain my skin, and keep it in, in good shape. But um, skincare is something that I'm definitely, um, I don't skimp on, and this is something that I do take time out of my day to put into my routine. So one of my favorite items um, that really helps me, I think, with, with really... Um, cleansing and exfoliating the skin without over exfoliating the skin is joystick. This is a solid cleanser. I also love this because I travel a lot. So this is solid. <laughs> and because that little bag that you have to put through TSA, those little liquids in there, I mean, that's a very small space. So this is nice that this doesn't have to go into that bag and I can um, travel with this everywhere. But joystick is a solid cleanser slash um, exfoliating stick that uses Moroccan clay um, that really helps with the skin as well. It's got um, little exfoliating beads in there that really help to get those um, blackheads and things away from the nose area, the chin area, wherever your problem area is. So I definitely use this at least once a day. Um, in the morning, I'm more so am, um, more about exfoliating. I know a lot of people do it at nighttime, but I like to use this in the shower after I come in from a workout. So um, the joystick is the one that I love. And then I love to mask at least once, to, one or two times a week. Um, the Blue Agave Mask, I like to use a lot of times during the day. I'm not gonna use this one today because I actually masked yesterday, but the Blue Agave Mask is an amazing peel off mask. And I will do a tutorial on this um, or a video on this at a later date, but this is a beautiful mask um, to really help to deep clean, exfoliate the skin and also brighten the skin and hydrate the skin. I use two cleansers every day, morning and night. I'm, you know, it was funny because um, pre-cleanse to me was always a very scary thing. So because a lot of pre-cleansers are oil-based um, because they help remove makeup and dirt and debris from the skin. And with me, um, having, having acne-prone skin, anything with oil really scared me. So I really had to educate myself that there are good oils out there. And uh, Melt Away has one of the best is one of the best cleansers in my opinion. Um, it has 13 essential oils in here that really help to break down makeup, dirt, debris, remove long lasting, long wear, waterproof formulas. But for me as well, it just adds that extra, you know, conditioning or moisturizing layer to my cleanse. My cleanser of choice is the Simplicity Cleanser. This um, is my favorite cleanser. This is such an amazing cleanser because it is gentle for the skin. It's for all skin types. Everything that I'm talking about today is going to be for all skin types. So if you've got oily skin, dry skin, combination skin, sensitive skin, everyone can use these products. You just might use them in a different combination. So Simplicity is the cleanser that I love to use. It's sodium lauryl sulfate free and it's very hydrating to the skin. So this is act actually going to give you an optimal cleanse. And then for my moisturizer, um, I love Get A Lift. This is um, actually Pure's nighttime moisturizer, but I like to use it during the daytime as well. So um, this is Get A Lift, and it has Vitinol, which provides retinol-like effects to the skin. Um, and you really see a difference in your skin. I like to call this one my suspenders for my neck and face. So to apply all these, it's quite simple. So I'm gonna turn on the water. You're gonna hear some water running because I need to get my joystick a little bit wet. 
So I just tap on that or you can wet your skin as well. And then you just massage it onto the skin. And this is going to cleanse the skin, but it's also going to give you that squeaky clean without, um, without drying out the skin as well. So this is just a really good cleansing step once again. Um, and I like to really focus it in those areas that I want that extra exfoliation. So don't forget your eyebrow area. We use a lot of eyebrow pencils. And those eyebrow pencils, we need to make sure that we're exfoliating really well there. My upper lip area to get those pesky little fun lines. And then you just are going to massage it in a little bit more and then you're just going to rinse it clean. So you can massage this for as long as you like or you can um, go a little bit longer on days that you need it to. But really focus in those areas that you need that, that good cleanse or exfoliation. Next, I take my Simplicity Cleanser. Now, I like to combine some of my steps. So I take my Simplicity Cleanser and I'm just gonna do a pump or two into my hand. Um, I'm not wearing any makeup right now, so it's I don't need that much of the cleanser. And then I take a little bit of the Melt Away and I mix these two together. So a couple of squeezes of the Melt Away and it really makes this beautiful lather and it's really gentle and soft on the skin. And you'll feel it hydrating the skin, moisturizing the skin, but also removing any of that dirt, sweat, makeup that you have as well. So this is a great way to cleanse the skin. And I do this twice a day. Um, the joystick I only use once a day, but the combination of the cleansers I like to use twice a day. So when you cleanse your skin, one of the tips I have is if you immediately feel it draw up and tighten, then you probably need to use a cleanser that's a little bit more hydrating. So right now my skin just feels good, it feels comfortable, it feels clean, it feels hydrated. So we're ready for my next favorite product, which is the Get A Lift. And for Get A Lift, again, I use this morning and night. Um, I'm all about anti-aging, and so this moisturizer is one that I really love because it's so lightweight. So for a lot of us who have more acne-prone skin, we don't want anything that's gonna feel heavy on the skin or feel oily. And this is like a beautiful hybrid between a serum and a moisturizer, if you will. So I really like to apply this right after I do my cleansing step. It just immediately absorbs right into the skin because we use that exfoliating joystick. And it's very lightweight. So even if you live in humid areas, this is a great moisturizer because it doesn't feel heavy on the skin. Now when you're moisturizing your face, always use the same moisturizer on your neck as well because whatever you put on the face, you wanna make sure that your neck gets that benefit too. And that's it. So very easy, very simple steps to make sure that you're taking care of your skin and looking after your skin because that's just going to make your makeup look even better. So hope you enjoyed these steps. If you liked it, please like my video and don't forget to subscribe. We've got great more, a lot of great content coming your way as well. See you soon.